How insane people walk. They walk around in the motorhome kicking. Here we have Kiki making biscuits. Can you show us how you do it? That's right. Here we have Benny showing us how he puts the music together. And we have Momo staying warm. It's supposed to get down to about 17 degrees tonight. Will we survive? We survived a night where the weather got down to 17 degrees, which is some minus eight or something Celsius. Solar panels are out there getting recharged. And yeah, we, we watch TV Last night, almost making my onion. onions are making me cry. The onion. Also, that's not the depression, that's the onion. Yes, I already cried about my trauma already today. So that's productive. Happy to see this transmission coming back over here. <laughs> <laughs> this is Mike, the lead mechanic over here at Butler ATV, and he is fixing our water pump. And we thank Curtis for all the great work. This is really good. Thank you, Curtis. Yes, sir. We love it. You're welcome. And this is Mike over here. He's putting the finishing touches on the water pump and over here at Butler ATV, where they work on everything. Yep. So. Everything's happening in one room. Mechanicing work, culinary delights, videography. Kiki's cleaning herself. And Kiki is cleaning herself. Oh my god. Motorhome living is pretty tight. It's 185 square feet in here. It's a tiny house. Today is January 19th, 2024. Me, Momo, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling, actually the word I used was blessed earlier because of the fact that Curtis, Mike, and Brad from Butler ATV have worked all day today on our motorhome. And yesterday they installed the newly rebuilt transmission. Today they installed the water pump, brand new water pump, and we chose technically i think we could have driven off but maybe not because the manifold needs replacing and our exhaust system needs a revamp and so we are happily waiting until monday the thing is is that it might not seem this way but i'm kind of shy at first because i'm always afraid of people being judgmental or I don't know, me and Cal have a kind of unique relationship. But we had some heart to hearts today with the mechanics as they were here in our home working in the engine bay. And it was just so nice to be validated in that, you know, yeah, let's do what makes us happy. And everyone else can just do whatever because it doesn't matter because we're just on our own unique journey. And it's funny when you hear that advice in kind of the least expected places, what that does for you. Because you can hear it again and again in a self-help context or from your friends even, or a yoga class or wherever you are. But to hear validating statements from mechanics who are your road angels who took you in, who allow you to get their water from their facility and put it in your tank, who offer you rides. 
it's it's quite an amazing experience and I don't want to say it's humbling but it just kind of it's it's a very human moment of just pure connection no matter where you both come from <laughs> Do you think today's the day we're going to roll out, Cal? I do. I do think today is the day. Today is the day. What is today? Today is Monday. Looks like Medusa's head. Turns out this is called a smudge pot. Put oil on it, and light it, and it gets real hot up here. This part evidently gets bright orange. But this is shotgun. Just a little tiny bit of pet. That's all you like? You like the side of Side. Hey. We are finally in a new place. We drove here. And to celebrate us being able to drive, an amazing dinner. It's a big deal. It's horrible. We're broken down. We're stuck. We're it's over. <laughs> the adventure is over. We're broken down. Why are you smiling? Because it's no pro it's not a problem. This is not a problem. But I think it's funny on YouTube everything's a big problem, you know? Everything is a massive problem. This was the throttle cable. So when I press the gas pedal, what it does is it pulls this and that puts gas into the carburetor. And it fell off because it needs a clip. I'm going to need anti-anxiety medication. Also, there's going to be wrinkles. I swear that form here just... know it by the end of this I'm gonna have gray hair and wrinkles I already look ragged and aged little lizard Creek. entering Mobile County going into loves to take shower so for me it's first shower in 24 days well, we've heard that loves has the best showers cleanest showers we're gonna find out also we're gonna see if we can have a one shower one shower two people scandalous scandalous <laughs> 
one shower. We're not gonna ask, we're just gonna have one, see what happens. The code is there, shower number three. This is shower oh, number eight, three. Four, three, two. Oh, there's the code, you put a code in. I don't see it. I can't, my eyes don't work that well unless I have my glasses I don't, on. Mine don't either. It's very nice, they have a fan. We don't even have to use our own towels. We should save these. They have beautiful blue towels. And this beautiful shower. Look at that, it looks lovely. That's why they call it Love's. Happy birthday, shower. <laughs> Happy birthday to Momo. Getting a shower. Yep. Is that a good birthday present? Yeah. <laughs> it cost $17. Yeah, he complained about the price from me. He said 17 I thought it was 12 <laughs> Embarrassing. What? I did. And she, she said, she said, oh yeah, it was 12, five yeah. years ago. It's really, really cold. No, no. Why is that? It's so cold. Yeah. Freaking cold. <laughs> I'm running the sink faucet, and when the sink faucet runs, the shower is nice and warm. But when I turn the sink faucet off, the shower becomes cold again. Let's see how it is now. Ah. That one is nice and warm. Enjoyable. It's hot. It's hot even. And this water over here, isn't that crazy? When it runs, and it's cold. This water is cold. It's a, it's a biome. They call it a biome. I have a head biome. So now I've messed up my head biome by having a shower. I just put hot water on it, so it'll probably come around. Um, what? I don't know. I thought you were slapping something to emphasize. I have a special hairbrush that my yeah. hairdresser Joe gave me, and yeah. it's supposed to disperse the natural oils that your scalp secretes. Mm -hmm. And it does feel really good on an edgy scalp. So, there you have it. And I have a short. <laughs> Brought hair uh -huh. so that there can be less maintenance. Uh, yeah, so. Okay, these are our tips. Um, what else? Okay, so baby wipes, very useful. There have been many, many baby wipes that have been used over the course of the last month. But you, your back, you have back knee. The back knee. Yes, back the, knee. So what I do is I have this dermafoliant. And I also have facial products that I've invested in for my own face, but I give him a little spa treatment. And I also put antibacterial soap on his back, so he has gotten by with a little help from me. We need to have another meeting. We might need to have another meeting and assess what we're going to do. Apparently, we are now getting 6.2 miles per gallon. So I think Cal is reconsidering everything. Like the soldier. <laughs> Rain drops keep falling on my head. Just like the guy who feed is too big for his bed. Nothing seems to fit. No raindrops are falling on my head. They keep falling. Didn't mean some talking to the sun I said I didn't like the way he got things done Sleeping on We didn't make it to New Orleans because the windshield wiper broke and it was raining so we stopped here in Ocean Springs, Mississippi it is a bridge going out to a cloud. Oh, wow. It looks like a Falmouth cutter. It's the cutest sailboat on the planet. Yeah. Falmouth cutter. 
We were in one of those once. How many? There's only like 20 in the world, right? There's, well, they made 41 and most of them exist, although some have been shipwrecked. This one has beautiful handrails, I think we would call it. Look at those handrails you could grab on. And if you were about to go over the side, you just grab right on there with the handrail. Look at that. That's crazy, isn't it? I wonder if they're part of the Falmouth Cutter group. We took this kind of boat around Long Island once. And Cal has sold it since then. So it's kind of very nostalgic to see the Falmouth Cutter. What's this hole for? <laughs> you, you put your lower uh, member in the hole and then you get your machete. Torture device. This is what they used to do to people. Yep, these this are is what they did to men who cheated on their wives. They had to put their dicks down this hole like that and then they chopped it. Ah. Wow. Wow, I never heard you say such vulgar thoughts. Ah. So let here's the assessment of where Wait, we are. Wait, I just want to say we just had a great bike ride. Yeah, we did. At o in Ocean Springs. Yes. And we walked onto the pier and we had a very expansive view of the gulf. I really I liked how the bridge went up and into the clouds. I like how we're in a place that is has vacation vibes. So it's the first time that I feel like we are actually getting to enjoy a place like actually it's a giant pizza happy birthday to me happy birthday momo I filled up the fuel just now and we drove 66 miles. I put in 7.2 gallons and got 9.1 miles per gallon. 9.1, now that is a reasonable number. Pipe, which is a flex pipe that I put on at some point. It's starting to rust. And this is a new tailpipe. New transmission. What we got? We got. Uh, Water pump? Oh yeah, that's big. Manifold gaskets. Manifold gaskets. Manifold's also been been milled. shaved and Sorry. milled. Yeah. Spark, Spark plug. Yeah. New ignition. So really good. 
All right, here we go.